Hello everyone, so this is Rahul here and I'm going to be speaking about that how your cat is really easy and the people who are stressed out, this is the time to relax and I'm going to give you a couple of strategies which are going to help you uh, how to crack a cat on the day. Uh, this video is going to be mainly um, useful for those people who haven't practiced much mocks and I'm going to tell you about a strategy called G strategy, what does G stand for, uh, we're going to talk in a minute. Uh, let's move to the next slide. All right, so let's look at this this thing, something called a G strategy. So G strategy is nothing but it's called as a Garib strategy. Uh, Garib strategy, I'm just making it funny, but it's really serious stuff. This is for the people who have really, really uh, slogged much, but have not been given much of the mocks, uh, giving much of the mocks. So uh, I'm going to break the entire paper in front of you so that you can understand. Uh, let's look Let's look at the bottom uh, where I'm going to talk about that how many attempts you need. Uh, to crack IMA, IMA is... Yes, you know it. I'm a, I'm is I'm Ahmedabad. You need to get 80 correct, uh, 80 attempts, and get 60 correct. And then here, here there is I am a star again. So uh, I like this part the most. So I am a star is nothing but I am Amritsar. To get I am Amritsar, which means approximately 92 to 94 percentile, what you need to do is you need to attempt 60 questions and get 40 right. Let's speak about that later on. What I've done right now is, as you all know, the first section, which is verbal ability, there are 34 questions to it. And um, the second section, LR plus DI, there are 32 questions to it. And the fourth section is 34 questions. Now, we as a human being are really good in slotting and achieving small targets and small goal. So what I've done is quickly, I have broken down the entire cat section number one into two pieces where I'm, I'm telling you that there are 17 questions. Let me correct it here. There are 17 questions in the first section and 17 questions in the in the second section. Similarly, the second section I'm broken down into two pieces. And what I'm telling you is you need to divide the entire cat paper into 30 minute slots. I hope you guys are with me. You need to, uh, you need to uh, slot the entire paper into 30 minute slot so that you can achieve the minimum target of getting somewhere around 10 marks to 13 marks sorry, questions in the each exam. So whenever I'm referring to 17 or 16, these numbers refer to the questions, not marks. Let's get going to the next slide. All right, so this is for a good guy, a guy who has been practicing a lot at home. Uh, your, my recommendation to all of you guys is, in the first section, as you've slotted down, your attempts out of 17 questions should be 13 questions, and you need to get a 10 questions correct. So in short, in the 30 minutes time slot, I'm giving you a chance to, um, to clock in 17 questions again and get attempts of 13, which means you can, you can leave four questions for sure. A twenty percent of the cat paper could be left without solving it. I repeat, twenty percent of the cat paper could be left not solving it. In fact, we teach you in the class: leave the questions and get more marks. LTQ GMM to get I am Ahmedabad, you need eighty attempts and somewhere around sixty correct. Uh, let's look at the section number two again. You get seventeen questions and you do fourteen correct. Uh, 14 attempts and you got ten questions correct. So what I've done is I've given you attempt 13, 14, 13, 14, 13. And to your amaze, 13 plus 14 plus 13 plus 14, it adds to 81. And hey, our lucky golden number is 80 to get the attempts. So I ask you again, in 30 minutes time, you need to attempt 13 questions. Let me define the value of an attempt or a definition of an attempt. A definition of an attempt is, if you know the question, you should be able to solve it. If you don't know it, you should be smart guess it. All right. So people who are targeting I am Ahmedabad only who are like dying for it, want to get it. There should not be any section where you're losing, uh, losing more than 13, uh, you, where you're losing more than four questions which you're leaving unattempted. But again, you got 13 minutes and you need to get 10 correct. If you get 10 correct in each section, this add up to 60 marks, 60 questions again. So this is your ideal attempt for I am Ahmedabad. I repeat, people who are really focused on Ahmedabad, Bangalore, Calcutta. This is the strategy which you need to follow. What happens in this strategy is, first of all, paper, paper setter is very smart enough. From question number one, two, three, question number four, up to question number 100, he's very smart enough that he is given moderate, easy, difficult in the entire section. All right. I repeat, he has given moderate, easy and difficult question in the entire section. When you are spending equal amount of time in the each mini section, you are not missing out on the difficult, sorry, on the easy questions in that section. It means if you are spending more time in verbal ability section number 
1A, say the first 16 questions or the first 17 questions, you are definitely solving the easier ones and not wasting time on 30 questions or not wasting time on the difficult questions. Um, mark my words, most of you guys, when you come out of the CAT paper, you're going to come and tell us like, hey, uh, the paper was easy, but I could easily solve five to eight questions more. So uh, don't miss out on the easy questions. By this strategy, we call it 30-30 strategy. By 30-30 strategy, you should be able to uh, do justice to the entire CAT paper and solve the easier questions. The next slide is the most important slide, which I'm going to present right now. All right, so this is called the G strategy. This is my favorite slide. This is for the people who haven't been studying hard or who are really nervous about their cat and are not 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 targeting a 99.99 percentile. I know everybody should target, but people who are not or people who are really bugged, like what's going to happen, are really scared. Let me make your life easy. Uh, in the same way, what I'm going to do is I'm going to crack your, I'm going to plan your entire cat paper in a G strategy way. G means Garib strategy. Let's look at the verbal ability. I repeat, I am going to be breaking down the entire cat into different, different sections. And I'm going to give you section wise 30, 30 minutes each in solving all the questions. Let's look at verbal ability section number one. What's going to happen here? You've got, mm -hmm, you got 17 questions to do and you need to attempt only 10 questions. I ask you one simple question. If I give you 30 minutes and I give you 17 questions, would you be able to attempt 10 questions of any topic, say LR, DI? By the definition of attempt, I'm asking, would you be able to look at the questions? If you know the question, you should be able to solve or these 10 should be the easiest question which you can find and solve it in 30 minutes. Trust me, guys, your strategy to get I am a star, which means I am Amrit Sir, is in each section, just pick up the 10 questions in 30 minutes and get me 10 correct. I repeat, pick up the 10 questions, get 7 questions correct in 30 minutes. 10, 7, 30, 10, 7, 30, and keep going in. To the beauty of this equation, this adds up to 60 attempts and 7 into 6, and you get 42 correct. That's it. This is equal to a 92 to 94 percentile plus, signed by blood, which means you can get an Amritsar, you can get maybe a couple of more IMs if you want. Uh, last year, the last person to get IM Bangalore even is 90 percentile. She's a girl. It's an RTI done on that any which way, um, one of the cases. But, um, but what I'm trying to tell you guys here is that you can get... Um, even SPJ in Bombay, definitely you can be a good scorer for a uh, go good guy for a MICA because most of the guy expect these percentage. SPJ in Bombay, which is a profile-based college, and MICA, and couple of new col uh, couple of uh, colleges like Tupmi and and many more for Nirmar, so on and so forth. So this is your strategy. People who are really nervous about their CAD, you need to do is. Pick up your questions, pick up the sets. After every one hour of the time, you, you, can, you can maybe relax or have a break and keep getting 10 questions right. That's it. Uh, any questions you have in this, you can maybe write in the comments and uh, we are also available on Facebook. Uh, my Facebook page is Rahul Cat King. I'll speak about that in a minute. Okay, so again, uh, 60 questions, 7 correct, time allotted is 30 minutes each. That's it. You can practice that at home also for the couple of days whenever your cat is. Let's move to the next slide. Okay, before I thank you, I'm going to give you a couple of tips. Number one, there are three things which you which you can take on the day of cat. Number one, um, Red Bull. So um, Red Bull, Red Bull works. Uh, Red Bull is 10,000 calories plus, and you can have a Red Bull for sure before you enter the exam. Maybe you can try this before your mock if you got time. Uh, number two, there's a, there's a beautiful chocolate um, called Snickers. Uh, I really love this chocolate. Snickers is again high on energy. It's got some peanuts in that. You can chomp a couple of um, Snickers before you enter the class. And thirdly. Um, this my favorite biscuit Rithik Roshan uh, used to do this ad campaign um, I think this biscuit uh, yes uh, it's called hide and seek now he's doing for Milano also so hide and seek biscuits are also very important so these three things you should chop before entering the exam hey guys this is one exam two lakh plus people are appearing uh, any small thing if it can keep your gray cells awake for maybe 30 more minutes or maybe can get you one more marks correct that's going to be helpful uh, feel free to whatsapp uh, this is Poonam's number you can set an appointment with me uh, on the Borovili really Pavai as well as Pune and we are also launching online programs. Um, look out for the workshop for Snap and Mattis, um, that and Micah. Yeah, that's one of the 
colleges which I admire too for any of the workshops. And I wish you all the best, guys. It's an easy exam. Uh, keep breathing in between the sessions. Every 30 minutes, you can relax. Every 30 minutes, you can stretch yourself. Uh, leave your pen, pencil, and mouse away and keep going. Um, trust me, when you come to the other exams like SNAP and MET, etc., you'll find CAT is the easiest exam. Uh, just go and uh, just go and crack it. There are no plan B's. If you are having any thoughts about, hey, I'm going to be looking for a job later on. Hey, uh, what, what's going to happen to me if I don't uh, crack it? No, 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 no. You're not going to be listening to any negative thought which is coming to your mind. You're going to crack it. You have studied hard. You have to have uh, you have to have a minimum uh, a G strategy marks that is 60 questions attempt and 40 questions right. All the best, uh, guys, and I'll see you again after CAT. We will be doing a quick review uh, immediately after your slot number one. I hope you enjoyed the video. Go kick some ass. Thank you very much. All the best. Bye, guys.